So Jake Paul's mansion just got raided by the FBI and what they found might shock you. Hey yo what's up YouTube it's me Givaz here and we got some good news. Jake Paul's house just got raided by the FBI. You heard me right the FBI itself. And this happened yesterday in the morning and at first we didn't know why the FBI was raiding his mansion. But later on that day we got some details on why. And today I'm going to be reacting on what they found at his mansion. But first I want to talk about what led to this all happening. So around May of this year, Jake Paul was arrested for looting some mall in LA. Not only was he looting, he was trespassing because the mall was closed and it was nighttime and obviously there was the whole pandemic going on so the whole thing was closed, so yeah. But this man is just so dumb. People started recording him doing it because obviously if you're a famous person going out in a public area doing something wrong, you're obviously going to be recorded and this man is just so dumb, so dumb. And after all that, he got arrested. But I don't know what happened afterwards, he just seems like he got bailed out or he got out of jail somehow and he just went back to his mansion. Now let's fast forward to July. So recently Jake Paul has been on the news for throwing a humongous house party in his mansion in LA. And maybe some of you are thinking, you know, I mean it's okay, he's throwing a party, it's okay, he has a humongous mansion, he's rich. And if you are thinking that, then uh, unfortunately you are very dumb because we are under a PANDEMIC. Like, uh, like, are you serious? We, we can't be partying now. <laughs> and there was a bunch of YouTubers at his party. And some of those YouTubers actually got COVID because of the whole party. And obviously it wasn't social distancing. There was no mask at the party. It was just so stupid. It actually got so serious that the mayor actually told Jake Paul that he's super immature and to stop partying because we're under a pandemic right now. And I totally agree. I mean, he's just so dumb. I think it's just those boxing hits to the head that makes him so stupid. So recently Jake Paul actually spoke out about this whole partying thing and he literally said he's not going to stop partying and he's not going to stop living his life. Like, oh my god, he's, he's so stupid. Alright, but let's get back to the whole FBI thing. So the FBI gets a search warrant for his house and they bring like the whole entire SWAT. There's like 20 men out there, they got their old AKs, M4s, they got everything, they got shotguns and everything everything it's like they're about to shoot jake down like what the heck but apparently the whole warrant thing was because they're trying to investigate the whole thing that happened in may when he was looting and all that and in the video it actually shows some people that were handcuffed and let out of the mansion but it doesn't seem to be jake so he might be out of state he might be somewhere else but they found something else in the mansion they found multiple firearms at his mansion when I was doing my research, I was trying to find out if he has a license to own that or if some other of his friends own that. But, I mean, it really doesn't matter. They found firearms and that's not really good. They got that firearms now and they have it in custody, but, like, it's not looking good for Jake. But if those firearms are Jake's and they find out that he does not have a license, oh boy, that's another thing that's going to be stacked on in court. And honestly, he should go to jail. There's just so much against him. First, he uses the protest as an excuse to trespass a closed mall and then loot the closed mall. And now potentially he has firearms without a license. I mean, he probably does have a license because he's rich and he's crazy. But if he doesn't, oh, oh my goodness, then he deserves to go to jail. And honestly, I'm just tired of seeing his face all over the place. Like, Jake Paul is that dude in class that just yells out stuff and nobody finds him funny. Like, he is not funny at all. I know his audience is like, what, 12 year olds? Like, middle schoolers? But like, man, he's just a, such a bad influence to his audience and to everyone around him. Like, he's just so dumb. And hey, if he goes to jail, that means KSI automatically wins the fight. <laughs> but what do you guys think? Do you guys think Jake Paul is guilty or should he be a free man? Comment down below. And that's all I have for the video guys, if you enjoy my content, please like, comment, subscribe, and press the notification bell button. And as I always say at the end of my videos, see you later!